and to help us pick, choose, and love our pajamas, and I love my pajamas, is Shona Jensen, everyone. Hi. Also a pajama lover. Oh, a deep, deep pajama lover. You got a lot hanging around your I house? I have a lot, and even divided by season and drawers. Oh my goodness. Like, I really love pajamas. Yeah, me too. I wear yeah. them as soon as I get home. I take out my outdoor clothes, put on my indoor clothes, and indoor clothes is pajamas. Okay, uh, if you come yeah. to my door, I'm usually in PJs and braless, and that's the way I like it. I probably have <laughs> at least 20 pairs of pajamas yeah. at home. I love it. Yeah. So what matters the most when it comes to picking the right uh, pair of pajamas for you? Okay, so first and foremost, I'd like to encourage everybody to treat themselves to pajamas. Yes. Like, don't have your pajamas be the afterthought. Yeah. And that doesn't mean spending a lot of money. It can mean that if you want to really, really treat yourself. Mm -hmm. But I really want people, I think when you feel good, whether you're at work or whether you're working out or whether you're doing the dishes, yeah. you just perform better and by that I mean in this case sleep better if you're in really comfortable pajamas that you feel cute in mm -hmm. it's just a cherry on top I genuinely think you're going to have a better sleep amongst a million other things to help you sleep better but I do think pajamas are important it's something to look forward to at night too like yes. let me put on my pajamas and I like my pajamas there's not holes all over them like yes. there's just I like to wear them yeah I agree so let's talk about what we're considering in our pajamas yeah so beyond the aesthetic beyond the cute yeah uh, fabric is really important mm. choosing the right fabric for you there's mm. a lot of good fabrics out there but the right fabric for you so let's go through a few of the different fabrics that are kind of commonly used in pajama yeah let's start with cotton starting with cotton yeah it's a terrific terrific fabric yes it is uh generally an it can be an inexpensive fabric it's really really easily to make into easy to make into different types of fabrics, so I'll get yeah. to that in a second. It's washer friendly, it's usually dryer friendly. Love that. Now what you want to look, and it's breathable. Mm -hmm. So what you want to look for in uh, your pajamas, it's it can be hard to find 100% cotton mm -hmm. nowadays a lot of things are blends and the bigger the blend the less breathable it's going to be the okay. more poly poly polyester yeah poly cotton mm -hmm. the more of that that's in there is the less breathable it's going to be so yeah. flannel pajamas for example if you're a cozy girl you're someone who is cold a lot I am cold a lot yeah I'm one of those people and so flannel pajamas are a really great option especially <laughs> here in Canada it gets pretty chilly yeah um and they're made of cotton that's a cotton thing right they're particularly hard to find in 100% cotton. Right. So if that's important to you, it is to me, look at the tag, look at the listing if you're buying it online. Look as for as little, as more cotton as you possibly can and preferably 100%. Okay. If you get 100%, they're going to shrink when they you put are. them in the dryer. Yeah. I am very conscious of shrinkage. I'm a really tall person. I'm six yes. feet tall. So I do not want to lose any length in the legs or arms of my pajamas. Right. And so I, if I have my flannel pajamas, for example, I hang them to dry. Okay. Only because I want to be conscious not of shrinkage. And I guess you can size up if you think you, can, you might, you know. You can definitely size up yeah. and also feel free to buy men's pajamas. Absolutely. Like, uh, there's so many reasons to look in the men's department. Yeah. One, if you're size sensitive, whether it be me, I want a little bit more length. Yeah. Uh, the men's sizing is usually one size larger than what the women's. So a women's medium is a men's small. Yes. Right? So you yeah. just go down. So you're going to have, you know, a men's double extra large. You, you're, they offer those sizes in a lot of regular uh, lines. Absolutely. So dip into the kind of men's department. And men's yeah. pajamas often have pockets in them. Almost always they yeah. have pockets. Uh, them, which totally. I love. Yeah. Is this one 100% so, cotton? So this one is not. This this, isn't. this particular pajama you're touching right now is not 100% cotton. Okay. Um, it's cute with the cats and dogs, it so I pulled cute. it. But you you can find them there. It's not hard. But yeah. cotton comes in different forms too. Mm -hmm. So there's different um, spins and sweaves and s the smoothness. Like yes. the pajamas I'm wearing here are from a company called Kip. Yeah. They are 100% cotton and they are luxury. Mm -hmm. They are so beautiful. But when you touch these pajamas versus for a flannel or a really inexpensive blend, yeah. you can tell the difference right away. And when you upgrade and really extra treat yourself into that luxury realm, you're going to get additions like these are lined in satin. They're so pretty. And they come with a travel bag. Yeah. 
And you're looking, there's cottons also come in, like, let's say, traditional method. There's organic cotton. And then these pajamas, for example, are the OEKO Tex certified. And that means during the fabrication, they're not using unnecessary chemicals and stuff, which are particularly good for sensitive skin people. Oh, very so, good. So all of that is, all of that is cotton. One yeah, fabric, and we just covered that. all that. The Kip ones, get you can get monogrammed as well, which is kind of sweet. Yeah, and they don't charge for the monogram, yeah. which I love. Yeah, yeah, which is lovely. Yeah. Okay, moving right along, uh, we're going to... Uh, uh, Modal? No, or, we're well, gonna, this or is sad. Modal. Sad we can go to Mel. Let's go to Modal. Let's go to Modal the just because it's one of my favorites. Yes, Modal is so soft. It's yeah. that kind of slouchy, slinchy, slinky fabric. Yeah. It is very clingy for those who mm -hmm. maybe don't enjoy cling. Yes. Um, it, it's very clingy, but it's a natural fiber as well. It's actually a cellulose from the beech tree. They spin it into a fabric. Oh. And so it's an eco-friendly choice. Good. It uses less water for production. Yeah. So there's lots of reasons to love it, but it's also very breathable. Why? Because it's a natural fabric. The right. more natural it is, the more breathable you're going to get. So if you yeah. run hot, that's a good choice. I find that those have been like a savior in menopause. I like the modal. Oh, you, for, for the and breathability. And I like the feel of it. Yes. Like right now, we're going to talk about silk versus satin. I'm in we a are. heat trap right now. Yes. So this is obviously satin. Exactly. So yeah. let's do that. Silk versus satin. I yeah. love them both. When you look at them, they may visually look the same. Mm -hmm. When you touch them, you can tell the difference you can. for sure. Let's start with satin. Satin yeah. is a man-made product. Mm -hmm. It is spun plastic, basically. Yeah. I mean, that's a crude synthetic. way of saying it, but it's totally synthetic. Mm -hmm. So that means zero breathability, hence why you None. feel like you're in a trap. Hot. Yeah. So if you run hot or it's a hot season, yeah. this is absolutely not for you. <laughs> yeah. It looks like it's going to be silky and cool, but it's yes. not unless it's silk. Now, because I run cold, I sleep in satin sometimes because I like the additional warmth a little yes. bit and I toss and turn and it slips in the sheets. So I yes. like that. So that works for someone like me. Uh -huh. Satin, on the other hand, is, or silk. Uh, or excuse me, silk on the other hand yeah. is luxury fabric. There's mm -hmm. usually a high price point that comes with that. Extremely breathable, mm -hmm. extremely uh, luxurious. Yeah but a little bit touchy to take care of. Satin, washer, dryer, no problem. No big deal. Silk, hand dry, no hand wash preferably, or hand cycle, yeah. definitely no dryer. It's, so it's a little bit more it's delicate. It takes a little I bit more work to take silk. care of it. Yeah, I don't have any silk either. It's Although too fussy. I do aspire to a fabulous pair of silk first. One day. For one day. When I grow yeah. up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm, when I'm responsible an adult. enough. Yeah. <laughs> Let's talk bamboo. Okay, bamboo is a really, mm. really, really good fabric. Yeah. It's it's made from bamboo fibers, so yes. it is uh, natural natural uh, fiber. Yep. Extremely soft, has a little bit of a give to it, less clingy than the model. Yeah. Um, and it's extremely breathable. They kind of coined this as nature's air conditioner. Yes. So if you're someone who's prone to hot flashes. I should have bamboo pajamas. Yes, you really should. Yeah. Actually, you should. Mm -hmm. And these ones are going to keep you totally comfortable. Also go washer, dryer. There might be slight shrinkage with these. Yeah. So if you're just barely making it, hang them to dry. Otherwise, they can go into the washer and the dryer as well. Love it. Yeah. And we're talking, last but not least, linen. Last but not least, yeah. linen. I love linen. Mm -hmm. It's Probably beautiful. half of my pajamas or linen. Oh, nice. But here's what you have to do with linen. You have to accept the brutal wrinkles that come with oh, it. Oh, yeah. They get very wrinkly. I love to iron. No surprise. Um, <laughs> nerd. Um, but I love to iron. So nothing I love more than a great linen pajamas out of the dryer and I crisp those up with the iron and slide <laughs> into them. I just love it. This is her idea of a good time. But it is. <laughs> um, so I really, really love linen. But it's beyond just the... the uh, fun of the ironing and the yes. laundering. It is extremely good fabric for pajamas. It keeps you warm when you need it. It keeps you cool when you need it. So yep. body regulating temperature. Yep. So either season. And it can go in the washer and the dryer. So it's really easy maintenance when it comes to that. I yeah. love that. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I, uh, you know, I already said I love pajamas, but I could have more. And if you want more, we have all of these looks linked. You can actually shop the whole show with that QR code on the screen right now. You just put your phone up to the screen. It'll take you to these items if you're looking for new PJs because now Shona's giving you all the information you need to know <laughs> uh, for which one to buy.